Imagine we got the latest version of Linux kernel. Think of it as an enormous brain that helps run our computer and phone seamlessly without us even noticing most of the time. Now, with its newest update, in this case version 6.12, this giant has been flexing some fresh muscles to make things faster, more efficient, or just cooler. So, let's break it down. First up, it's something called real-time support, which basically means that when there are tasks demanding immediate actions, like in self-driving cars, Linux can now promise to get things done quickly and without delay. This feature helps make decisions almost instantly, ensuring everything from a car safety system works as smoothly as butter on your morning rush hour scone. Next up are these new scheduling capabilities called Skid-EXT. Imagine you have friends who all want to play latest multiplayer game at their house party. The host, or in your case Linux, needs a way of deciding how long each friend gets on stage so they can enjoy themselves without everyone getting frustrated or waiting too much. Skid-EXT is like having more precise control over this social scheduling. It helps the kernel decide who and when to give CPU time based on your rules, which means you get a tailor-made experience for whatever job needs doing in real life. Now let's talk about troubleshooting. Ever had an issue with your device that seemed impossible until someone figured out what's up? Linux kernel version 6.12 make it easier to diagnose these tech hiccups by transforming complex error messages into QR codes, a shortcut we all know and love for scanning information quickly in our phones or tablets. This means if you're an Android user with your trusty device like smartphones, fixing issues become as simple as snapping together two pieces of Lego. Clang support Nope, not about actual clam farming here, but a tool that helps in writing and optimizing code for better performance, is now included alongside NoLibC, so if you're into coding, or maybe learning, this means more opportunities to play around with high quality build systems without needing lots of tools installed. The kernel also introduces something called CPU idle, which helps manage how much power our CPU use when they are not actively doing work, like during idle time or while waiting for input-output operations. Kinda similar to having a smart thermostat in your home that makes sure you're using energy only where and as necessary. For those who use code with C++, there are now bindings provided by libcpu power, which means it becomes much easier for both experienced programmers or beginners alike to write scripts that deal directly with power management features on our devices. Think of this as your toolbox getting updated so you can work more efficiently. Then comes the UEFI platform runtime mechanism, PRM a feature meant primarily for system using Intel processors which assist in translating addresses reported by memory controllers into physical system locations. Imagine someone giving out room numbers at an event and helping guests understand where the rooms are without confusion. Now let's not forget about microcode patches, these tiny updates that help fix issues on older CPU generations. With Linux kernel version 6.12, this is easier than ever to load such fixes into newest Intel processors like Zen-based ones. Imagine updating your device or computer faster with less hassle. And lastly, but definitely not least, our friends at AMD who make some of the latest CPU chips for high performance. Linux kernel version 6.12 takes great care to include their hardware in its realm, which means software built on top can now take advantage of these new features without extra fuss. Is like being handed a magic wand that instantly works with your tech. So what does all this mean for you? It simply states that modern Linux kernel is getting smarter and more efficient. For developers, there are better ways to interact directly with the hardware they're building software on top of. For managing power efficiently, like how we conserve energy at home, or even fixing issues when something goes wrong. It's like having an AI assistant that simplifies everything. Imagine all these features combined into a big open source toolkit for making computers and phones work better. The world of technology is constantly advancing, like how we go from flip phones to smartphones, so the latest Linux kernel update ensures your device keep up with the space without you having to lift an eyebrow or a single finger. To sum it all up, these updates are like getting upgraded software for our computer's die brain, the operating system. It's about making things run faster and smoother than ever. With Linux kernel version 6.12 rolling out these new features, from real-time support to AMD hardware compatibility, we get a powerful, versatile tool that helps us write better software while also being mindful of power use or simply fixing issues when they pop up. It's like having your cake and coding on top. 
Linux kernel version 6.12 is not just an operating system update. Think more efficient, faster processing for everything from cars to smartphones, all thanks to these latest changes that are a big deal in Techland and it's great news as they're making technology work better and smarter. So next time you fire up your device or computer using this powerful brain of Linux kernel 6.12, just remember there is some cool science magic happening behind the scenes to make everything click into place. And as always, if you find this video useful, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next one.